the most famous football club in the world is searching for a new breed of player. Go ahead, guys. Target located. Assessing skill level. This kid's the real deal. Hey, guys. Speed, 96. Resistance, 95. It's not about football. It's not about the games. It's not about winning or losing games or scoring goals. It's much more uh, an adventure series, uh, the way we are uh, planning it. And uh, yeah, it's about a group of uh, scouters representing uh, FC Barcelona, traveling the world, finding the right uh, kids to uh, participate in a tournament uh, under the Barca colors. Hopefully, uh, uh, this is a very global content project. Uh, it, it pretends to appeal to uh, everyone especially the kids, but also the families. It, 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 the intention is to attract people to football, to Barca. And why not? Obviously, the first thing is to transform people into fans. Obviously, if we, if we manage to find the next Messi through or because of this uh, series, uh, it will be a cherry on the cake. If you know Russell Wilson, you know his story. He was taken 67th in the draft. And that's the, that's the kids I, I, I hope to speak to in this series. Not the number ones and the number twos, because they're great. And if they have a natural skill and a talent, there's nothing wrong with that. And that's awesome that they can develop that and exploit it and be... But we can't all be Russell Wilson. We can't all be Michael Jordan. We can't all, most of us are going to just have to play within our skill level, but that doesn't mean we can't be great within those limits. The worst thing you can do in a kid series, I think, is get on a soapbox and preach to them or feel like they're being taught a lesson. So it's really kind of like, it's a little bit like smoke and mirrors. You, you want to entertain. First and foremost, you have to entertain. You have to create characters that kids can identify with, that they want to come back to, they want to spend time with. So the lessons that they're learning, has to, it has to fly a little under the radar. It can't be just in their face or they get bored of that real quick and they, they move on because sure. they want to have fun. And that's the best way to teach a lesson is a lesson that sort of sneaks up on you by the end of an episode where they have been entertained, they've laughed, and then they kind of ponder and go, oh yeah, you know, some, you know, there's a moment where they go, okay, I get that. I think we found our striker. Pasando, ganando. 